right, so file this next story under random meetings that turn into much more. It is about a rideshare driver and a single passenger who helped make a dream come true. Rachel Gilman Rischel runs her public relations company out of her Chicago home, but meets clients all around town. So I met Sydney over a year ago. Hi Hamilton guys. Yes, yes. Rischel got in Sydney Davis's via car to hear him singing along to Hamilton the musical. Yeah. But the revolution's imminent. But not just singing. If you stand for nothing, Bert, what will you fall for? Rapping. Heard a drop knowledge, I'm a diamond in the rough. Feeling the music and doing it pretty darn well. This is not a moment, it's the movement. History, hip hop, and politics. You can line me up at that buffet all day long. So I'm completely enraptured. I'm loving the performance. I ask if I can take a videotape of it. And he's like, sure. I am seeing the best minds of my generation. Waste away in pestilence and starvation. This is that video, and it got more than 17,000 views on Twitter. At that point, had he seen the musical? No. Have you seen it? I'm like, no. <laughs> What was his explanation for why he hadn't seen it? The ticket price. Rischel didn't think much about the interaction until this past summer when Rischel called for a via and lo and behold, Sydney was her driver again and he still hadn't seen the musical. Okay, Rachel. At this point, it's more than coincidence. You need to help get him to Hamilton. Okay. Rachel reached out to her network of PR friends as well as VIA to secure tickets. Turns out September is Driver Appreciation Month, and VIA offered to pick up the tab for two Hamilton house seats in Chicago. You could have knocked me over with a feather. I, I mean, I, I was just that overwhelmed, overjoyed, stunned, amazed, humbled, grateful. If it wasn't for the fact that I'm a dude and I don't cry, <laughs> I'd have been in tears. <laughs> and so Sydney, the singing rideshare driver, I am not going away my will go to Hamilton in Chicago with his wife of 23 years. I think there is real value in striking up conversations sometime and figuring out if there is some commonality. All thanks to a single passenger who decided to try making a random stranger's dream come true. So he said, Rachel, aside from the days when my children were born, this is the best day of my life. But the harder the conflict, the more glorious the triumph. Sydney and his wife went to Hamilton last night. They also had dinner at a Loop restaurant as well. And here are some of those pictures. That's hey. his wife, Alana. They did go there last night to Hamilton. And um, I haven't talked to him yet, but um, I do plan to reach out to him. And he said at one point, I don't know who's sitting next to me, but I feel bad for him because <laughs> I'm going to be wrapping the whole thing. <laughs> oh, that story just warms my heart. Yeah. That's It's really fantastic. A little random meeting, yeah. you know. Thanks for, thanks for sure. the story. That's a good one.